Hello, good morning. In this tutorial today, we're going to see how to use the picture frame command. The picture frame command, it's on viewport layout. Oh, sorry, sorry we are on um, Rhino 5. Okay, so if we open the viewport layout and tab, here we see the picture frame command. Picture frame, and now we just have to select a JPEG image, open, and here you see first corner of picture frame is going to be the starting point of the picture frame. We need to place it as if it was a rectangle or a surface. For instance, we can start by typing on the keyboard zero, enter. So we will start from the intersection of the three axes. Okay. And then for instance, we can press shift so we can set the length of the picture frame. So once we've done that, we will see our picture set on the on the top view we can also see the, the picture from the perspective it's like a like an image but it looks like a surface I mean technically this is a surface okay you see here type open surface so for Rhino um, technically speaking it's a surface also if you have a look at the text here you will see that it has transparency you can see the back of the objects. Okay. So as it's a surface, we can trim it for instance. So we can draw a rectangle. Well, several ones. Rectangle or circles, for instance, or ellipses, any kind of core. Let's make it smaller. Something like that. Not so big. Okay, so now we can, for instance, use trim, sorry, split, and we can split this surface using these three objects. Enter, and now we can get rid of this, so we will have three small surfaces. So, yeah, that's where it is. It's one surface, another surface, and another surface. Then we can just select one of them and just rotate it also on the other side and just align them if we want All right. it's just like a surface so we can also um, scale them either 3d 2d 1d whatever so you see Okay. And yeah, that's basically it. Thank you so much.